Welcome to the tutorial for the French Sounds app. This is uh, applicable for version 1.5. And this will be presented on the iPhone simulator, Retina Display. But it's uh, largely uh, applicable to the iPad version as well, since it's functionally identical. Uh, finally, the, there is a free version, which is uh, limited, of course. And I will uh, cover the, those limitations as we go through. Let's look at the reference area first. Uh, we'll go to touch in here. In this case, it's simply a matter of touching any of the, the phonemes, the this, this sounds, um, which are expressed in terms of the IPA uh, symbols, and hearing the sound that uh, corresponds. Now, some of these uh, symbols will no doubt uh, appear very foreign to you, but uh, they are legitimate IPA symbols, and they're uh, worth the trouble to learn, for sure. And that's it for the reference section. Um, in this uh, detail section, instead of playing the sound, it actually uh, will, will, will see details, including um, a few words that uh, exemplify it. Ed. Ed. You can press this to hear the sound itself. D, 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 d. Ed. Ed. Do. And then uh, press the example words. Do. 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 Maybe we'll pick one that's uh, probably quite foreign. Mm, mm, mm. Blon. 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 Mon. 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 Bonté. Bonté. Mm. And that's the sound of it. Um, so we'll go to the final uh, reference uh, section. Now, uh, just a cautionary note, this is a very uh, basic uh, voice synth. Um, it's, uh, the, the intended purpose is to, if you, if you look in the dictionary and you see IPA symbols, you can type them in here to get a very rough idea of how the word would sound. I'll give you one example. Ah. Yeah. You click it to hear all the uh, the uh, phonemes together. And when you're done, you can just swipe and erase it. Again, it's a very basic uh, voice synth, but it might be useful. We'll go to practice. Uh, we only have one practice uh, type. It's touch in here. Uh, now that was very faint uh, because I was speaking, but we can uh, show the skip button now or the repeat button. Okay, and and uh, you notice that I it glowed green because I got it correct. Okay. And it's just like that. You go through, and uh, you can, uh, if you get it wrong, Ooh. it'll glow, uh, glow red, and uh, it'll repeat the, the the phoneme that you missed. Uh, finally, you can, if it's uh, too intimidating to go through, be presented with all of the, the phonemes, quite a few, you can toggle off and on any of them. So we're only presented with this. E? E A B E And as you get more comfortable, you can add more on here. E And, uh, of course, this this will determine which uh, letters are presented. I'm uh, sorry, which uh, phonemes are presented. Uh, and finally, we can go to the, the test. And uh, here it's uh, it'll probably remind you of the reference in the practice, but it's other practice rather. It's quite different in that you uh, press a number, the phoneme that you think it is, and, but there's no there is no um, uh, indication whether it's correct or not. And uh, it's only at the end when you do 100 that you're presented with your with your score. Okay. Well, it's quite challenging, actually, the, the test, so I would advise uh, going for quite a bit of practice. Uh, sh I can point out now that 
Um, for, for the free version, there is no test, uh, because the test, uh, you really need a full set. And the limitation of the free version is is uh, the number of the letters, uh, the number of the phonemes, rather. Uh, in which case, there are only, um, I don't remember the number, but there's a, there's a limited uh, amount. I think it's a four, in fact. And that covers both practice and reference. And the synth, in fact. So uh, finally, we'll go to the info screen. And in this case, you can press the tutorial to uh, to see this uh, very video. Uh, the support site. Uh, review. Um, of course, uh, I would prefer a positive review, but uh, negative constructive reviews are very welcome. Uh, they give me ideas about how to evolve the app. And uh, finally, there's a with the French, there's uh, three other apps um, that I can offer. Each one has a paid and a free version. Okay, This, I would say, is um, probably the third most advanced after alphabet numbers. Uh, maybe even the most advanced, because it's for fine-tuning uh, your pronunciation. And that concludes the uh, tutorial for French sounds. I hope you enjoy the app, find it useful, and I especially hope to hear from you. Thank you very much.